Hello guys and welcome to the tutorial about SuperDS. In this tutorial I want to show you how to work with SuperDS, how to list products directly from your suppliers into your eBay store using the SuperDS extension, how to set it up and how it works. So basically once you register and log into the dashboard, the second thing you want to do is go to your extension, SuperDS extension. If you don't have the extension, you can click on the pop-up on the bottom left on the dashboard. It will redirect you to the Chrome extension store and you can safely download the extension from there. The next thing you want to do is click on the automation and click the sync orders button. This way you will be able to use the dashboard insights and the orders. And we basically sync all your orders from eBay directly to your um, SuperDS dashboard without any API connection. So we don't risk your account. It's basically give you insights about your store and about your orders, and which is really important and nice. The next page is the orders page where you can see all your orders. Again, you have to enable the sync orders. All your orders from eBay will be here. It's super important, and super easy to manage everything in one place. So SuperDS gives you a full suite to do everything. The third page is the My Products page. Basically, we will show you your all products um, that being uploaded with SuperDS extension in this products uh, tab. Here you can see um, the supplier, the store, your eBay store, the supplier that you uploaded the product from. You can manage everything in one place and it's super easy to track. Um, so it's really good to have it in one place. The next page is the title builder. We created a unique title builder for free in SuperDS, which basically gives you the best um, high keyword, high, uh, high search volume keywords that real customer used. So for example, if I choose the United States marketplace, I will choose the iPhone, let's say iPhone 13 uh, mini. I will try, for, for example, this phrase. I can see this is the phrases which real customer used on eBay.com. To, they, they really search iPhone 13 mini letter case. So it's super important to use this feature. I think it's highly recommended and it's really very helpful to optimize your eBay titles and create winning titles using this feature. The next feature is the product finder. In SuperDS, you can basically purchase amount of hot products that already been researched by us. So it's products on eBay that are winning products to upload to your store. So it's super easy to do. You should just purchase coins. You have several packs and you can purchase your SuperDS um, coins and then buy hot products with these coins. I highly recommend to use it because it saves a lot of time using um, this feature. The next feature is the Vero Checker. We basically have a lot of Veros in our um, SuperDS um, that we collected um, among the years. So we do it for you when you upload products with our extension, we do verify um, and check against our Vero collection. But if you do, if you do want to do it manually, if you don't want to change your eBay titles um, and to build ones and you need to check your title, you can always do it manually here. So for example, let's just write down with some Veros. Let's write a title with Veros. So my title will be new iPhone 12 and Apple or Nike or Adidas or whatever. I will click here and you can see it will highlight all the products, uh, all the titles, all the words from the title that are Veros. It's super important to use this feature and don't upload Veros because it's risk your account. The next settings are the pricing strategy, uploader settings and bulk uploader. These all related to the extension. Let's go over them. Pricing strategy is basically how you price your products how you plan to price it. So for example, um, let's see. For example, there is a product that costs $2. You can see we have several ranges here. I can add more ranges. So for example, if the product costs $2, it fall um, in this range because it's less than uh, five and more than zero. 
So the final price will be multiplied by two and not less, the final price will be not less than three. So if the product costs $2, it will be multiplied by two, which final price will be four. You can have an option to round prices as well. Uh, for example, from 9.2 to 9.99. Um, and you can add more ranges. You can change the multiplier. You can change whatever you need in order to success. So it's super easy to work with. I highly, highly recommend it. Um, the next thing is the uploader settings. What you need to do basically, um, you don't have any settings on the extension at all. Even if you try to go to general or supplier settings, it will redirect you here to the dashboard. Let's go over it. The first thing you need to do is choose the marketplace region we are working on. So we are working on United States, eBay.com. If you work with eBay UK, for example, you just click United Kingdom and save. Next thing is the duplicate to mark photos. If you want your listing to be always duplicate the photos to maximum, I highly recommend to keep it on. It's very, very useful and it, it helps to optimize the listing. The next thing is fixed item specifics. If you want to add fixed item specifics to your listing, you can add more under here. So for example, like this and save it. Let's use this as a tutorial just to show how it works. Next is the, is the border main image. If you want to add border to your main image, it's really nice. You can choose the colors. You can choose whatever you want. So let's keep it like um, maybe yellowish like this. I will save it. The next thing is the template listing settings. For each supplier, you can have its own template and um, different settings. So for example, for AliExpress, I can choose my template. Right now it's final. So it looks like this. I can also change the shipping section. So this is a custom shipping section. I can change the payment and the returns. And the next thing I can change is the country where the item location. So I can change to whatever country I want that it's supported on eBay. I will keep it China. Item location is multiple location. I can change it. And again, it's per supplier. So for example, if I go to eBay, it will be different template. Um, if I go to home, let's say to Pulse TV, it will be country US because this is um, a US based uh, supplier. So everything is super dynamic according, according to your needs. If you don't want to use our templates, you can use your custom template and you can paste your HTML and use these variables to inject um, the title and descriptions into your HTML code. So I don't want to use custom template. Let's use the base templates we have right now. I save this and this. And let's try to upload the product. Before we do it, let's go first about the bulk uploader. Um, I will show it later after I upload the product. This is like a pre-made product. I already been imported to the bulk. Second thing is the billing, where you can see your subscription. You can see the transaction on Super DS and so on. The last page is the settings, where you can change your name, change the currency settings. The referral code, for example, in the currency settings, if you prefer to show the products, the prices, the dashboard insights on Euro, you can change to Euro instead of US dollars. I will keep it US dollars. You can join our affiliate program um, by copy the code and give to your friends when you register and put your coupon code. You will earn a 50% uh, commission fee for life, which is very nice. So let's try to upload the product. After we save our uploader settings, we can just go to the products we want to upload, click on here. You can choose whether it will be classic or advanced. I always use advanced because it's nice. You can see all the images. This is the red ones. It's images that are from the description of the list. And you can un unselect them, which make which will basically result in uploading those images as well. So let's upload this image as well, this, this, this. 
And this is the variations. We can change the variation name in here, whatever we want. Let's change it to green. Let's change it to the yeah, better purple. The quantity for each variation. And let's click upload. Once we click upload, it will open an eBay page for us. We are doing everything without any API. So we will open the eBay page. We will um, copy the images from the supplier directly to eBay, but we will clean them. Uh, we will clean the metadata and everything so it will be safe to use. We don't risk your account in any way. Um, so let's, ju what, let's just wait for it to finish. It usually takes 30 seconds to upload the product. Here we uploaded the product. Let's go over the product. You can see the item specifics being pulled from AliExpress. This is the fixed item specifics we um, set on the dashboard. And let's go to the variation. You can see the variation names according to what we change. Also, also the price is uh, multiplied by two. We just flow it down to, uh, to 5.99. Um, you can see the images, you can see the main image. Let's wait for it to load a bit. Yep. The main image should be um, with the yellowish border we chose to highlight our listing. So the next feature is the fill UPC. Basically, when you put UPC on your listing, eBay will give you more um, uh, will give your listing more uh, impressions. It will it it, it will uh, it will be very helpful to your uh, sales when you get more impressions, more organic traffic. It will be uh, easier to list. Easier the the list will be much uh, will attract much more buyers. So here we with one click we fill UPCs for all your variations. Very easy. Once we're done, you can upload the po you can just upload to eBay and it will be directly in your products on Super DS. Here is the template we chose. You can see it uh, pasted uh, the description, the image, and the shipping policy. This is the custom shipping uh, section we added. It. This is the eBay we uh, uploaded from AliExpress. Uh, this is the custom here that we uploaded. Um, that's it for the upload of the one product. It was super easy, super simple. There is more, more, uh, there is more videos in the academy you can check and see for yourself. Um, the next thing, uh, you should see the products here. After, after you upload your products to eBay, it will be just here under the product. You can manage it, go to the supplier and so on.